700 crow, almost, right around, and I'm going to show you my personal tips on how to push up high. One thing you're going to want to do is you want to make sure you're on a good map for that character. For example, crow is pretty good on showdown. So what you want to do is you want to get a box if you can. I'll let this one burn. And this is a really good map because there's to push just about anyone. Because there is the bot that will spawn and that makes people die a whole lot faster. Okay. I, sh I beat Leon here at this range, and Leon's trying to third party. I guess now I'm third party. Oh boy, that's powerful, ape it. I just need my ultimate. That's basically your safe. Now, normally you want to check the bush, but since I just walked past there, I knew that there wasn't anyone in there. Just checking the bush is just simply shooting into them. Make sure that there's nobody in there that's going to hurt you. Oh boy. There's the other crow down there. And one thing you always want to do is you know who else is still alive. So the best way to do that is by looking at who's got kills. Oh boy. So right now I know that there's the crow and this ape it. And that crow should be just about dead. There we go. And he killed me as well. But see, we got second place there. Gives me eight whole trophies. If we can't get another win, or at least positive trophies. See, they're going down there. Tara will probably beat me. I just want at least one box. You have to know your character too. For showdown, Crow just needs one or two power cubes, and he can still win because of his control effects and everything. But some people you need a lot more. Like Tara. Tara's hard. Tara will kill me here though. I do have to play a little bit safe. Hmm. I should be able to get some chip on him. And we're just gonna wait. Tara's gonna. Tara's scared. She doesn't really want too much damage taken. But she, she could kill me. So I'm also scared. I have to play it safe. We're both just kind of chipping and waiting for our ult to mate. I'm gonna leave her alone. Let Crow fight her. There's still ten people alive. I don't want to be the first. Now there's nine. Of course there's. I don't want to say it. People you're going to want to avoid are people who can burst you, have more power cubes than you. System. Okay, I don't like spinning, but in this situation where there's eight people left, you are going to have to do something, or else you'll be gone. Alright, I think, yep, that's about it. But, I did get 4th, so that is positive trophies. It's a lot better than 8th, so I'll take it. Play another couple games. If you want to see more games like this, where I'm pushing Crow, I'm going to try to get Crow to a top 200 at least. And, I think I just have to get to like 800 and I'm top 200 in North America. And then, we'll see.
too much further if you push for after that. I'm probably going to cut this part out. Alright, so here we go. We start off with a box, which is better than nothing. I think, is that a colt over there I hear? Oh, a colt killed a pan. Piper. Interesting. Hmm. Yep, there is a colt right there. I might be able to get three boxes. And maybe kill the colt. Maybe. These colts are gonna team against me. Not nice. I'm not, nope, I'm not gonna take go for that box. They will kill me there. They're controlling me very well. Colt is one that I can three shot when I have equal power cubes. Oh my goodness. That's a powerful Colt. But I do not want to fight him from this range. If I can help it. One of my favorite places to hide is behind a cactus you can do so much protection from just a simple cactus however I might just end up negative I'm a little cornered here however, this uh, colt might have just saved me Oops, sorry. I don't want to be mean to him right now. He will clearly kill me. Uh, again, I don't really pick, choose teaming, but if you're going to play someone who's really good in showdown like Crow, sometimes you have to team till you just to survive. Not necessarily target someone, but in my opinion, that's not as bad. As long as you're just not killing each other, basically. I want to get away from that. That will kill me. There's just three of us. I can't. Might. Nope. I had just run in a straight line to get away from the bot, and that's exactly what Colt excels at. But because of that, we were able to get second and play one more game. There's a difference between teaming and just work. Uh, Spinning with someone so that they don't shoot you, they don't, you don't shoot them sort of a thing. It's not necessarily a huge difference, but it's big enough. I, I do not want to fight that right now. In duos, it's really good too. And he, that guy will probably kill 8-bit, I think. That it should. And I can kill him here. I can't kill him there though, that's too close. But there we go, that's more chip damage, he's gonna be about half health. Yep. Mm. You just have to know your range. If you're struggling to push, uh, look up a map that that character is good on right now. Because that also will help. This might not be necessarily the best map for Crow. But showdown is a really good game mode for him. I'm gonna apply some extra pressure there. Because the bot actually moves faster than 8 bits, so he will probably die. Yep, he's only got one more hit. There we go. We've got three crows. What else? That's including myself. Leon's over there. Oh boy. That's me gone. Oh, I tried to get the kill there. I think that's what fifth. Still positive trophies. So that's about how I'm gonna be pushing. If you want to see another video about that, I'll give more. Uh, thanks for watching. Goodbye.